Hey guys, this is Willowood. Just want to show you how I use Anki uh, with this video. And so the first thing you'll do is get it from the internet. And you can run it offline, but you just have to download the program from the internet. Uh, so you'll get it from here, Google Anki, or go to this website. Uh, once you have gone there, you can download it and open it up. And it'll look like this, except none of these will be here. These are decks that I've made. And what you want to do is you'll just want to create a make a set of cards, and in Anki they would call it a deck, so you create a deck. We'll call this the Reddit Test Deck. And so now, any if we want to add cards into this specific deck, then uh, we'll just click on it. Now, what's, if you want to have different ones, you could have, you know, if you had one for, if you wanted to have one for pharmacology and microbiology, if you wanted to split that up, you could, and just go into each separate deck and make cards in those decks. Uh, I like having mine all in the same place. Uh, I'll show you a little bit of that later, but in this Reddit test deck, uh, I'll show you how to make flashcards. So the first thing you want to do is just add. Uh, you see the type of card we've got is a basic card. There's lots of different types. A basic card is basically a note card uh, that you could hold in your hands, uh, front and back. And so the first, uh, the first, you know, just how to make a card, you know, how fast can you type? It's, uh, I want to work sort of off this outline. Uh, so you say uh, the enzyme efficiency in flesh syndrome is. Okay, so this would be the front of the card, obviously, and then, you know, quote unquote, flipping the card over on your computer, you'd be doing that. And so to get, we can keep adding cards or we can review some cards and keep adding, you just do that. To review, go here and you want to study these and so the enzyme deficiency blank. Obviously we just know, we know this because we just made it. Uh, and where, how, I'm, how I just advanced through that was uh, you can hit space bar or hit this button down there and that'll advance you. Uh, you'll see these buttons down here. I think to explain those best, we'll look at this picture. Uh, if you see this picture, well, that's too much. Uh, you can see the idea behind this is that uh, if you look at one thing one time on one day, uh, you remember it, you remember it, and let's say if this, if you drop below this line, you have forgotten it. Uh, so above this, above this gray horizontal line, you remember it, and then before you, you at this point you forgot it. And so the amount of time that you need to see this from here to here is short. So the first reminder, the first repetition that you get, uh, you know, maybe a day. Uh, but after you, after you hit that repetition, you're going to remember it for longer. You can read this graph. Uh, the more, you know, when you get these more and more spaced out over more and more time, uh, you, just, you hang on to it a lot longer. You see the slope of these lines is becoming less steep as you go out. And so that is what Anki tries to capitalize on. And you set the the gaps of time with these buttons down here. If you didn't know it at all, you go again, and it'll just pop up again. And if you knew it decently well, uh, you go good. And if you if it was if you knew it like you knew your first and last name, you would hit that one, and it would just push it way back. Uh, another thing you can do with this. So let's see. The uh, one way that I try to speed up things is use as many abbreviations as I can. Uh, so one thing that in Guillaume's book that he'll use is like. Uh, most common cause of death in diabetes patients is uh, it's cardiovascular cardiovascular disease. Uh, so this helps me because my, I would get so distracted by so many if there was if I used all these words and spelled them out all the way. But by using these abbreviations, it just helps me. I can just roll through it real fast. So most common cause of death in diabetes patient is cardiovascular disease. So we add this card, and that's just another flashcard that we've got front and back. Uh, most common. So I get to I get to this one. I see it. Most common cause of death. DB, uh, CDs. Okay. Uh, so you can see that's how you make basic cards. And that's the end of this video, but uh, in the next one I'll show you how to make the, the kind of cards that I have found that are very helpful for me to make.